My name is Tikpi Ernest Webster. I'm 33 with Down syndrome. And I am the one who discovered all about snakes and ladders for outside of this gorgeous path. In my mind, let's do something way big. Not a board game, but way, way bigger, but way on the ground. I thought, perfect time for putting this game on the ground at Sydney Olympic Park. Let's do it. My name's Nadia Odlum. I'm a Sydney-based artist. The collaboration with Digby grew uh, pretty organically, actually. Uh, well, we were both approached separately by the Sydney Olympic Parks Authority about doing a work in this space. When they told me they were bringing him onto the project, I was like, oh, Digby Webster, I love his work. So we first met each other here, looking at the space and talking through a few ideas. We were talking about games and that sort of thing and how we could bring games into public space. And I thought it was the perfect way then to merge our two styles. So my work is quite abstract and geometric. Um, and then Digby has this wonderful, colourful work that he does. And I'm happy I do animals based on my own artwork. It's not like snakes in the world. We've got lady beetles, frogs, lizards, eels, blue tongue, birds. I really like navigating some curvy lines. It's really cool and quirky. One of the times Digby and I came to do a site visit, we went to the Brick Pits, which is nearby, where there's a, a species of frog there, the green and golden bell frog, that was previously thought to be going extinct, but then they found this little colony of them there and are preserving them there. And then around Sydney Olympic Park, there's also lots of wetlands full of wildlife. We were interested in bringing in some of those creatures into this artwork. When I met Nadia out here, he take me and cover my family member out to this swamp right here and I, I got found, I, I listening to the, the sound of the wildlife animals sound like and water animals and I thought let's make these animals from the water and its sounds come to life it's easy to do that paint, draw and voila my name is Manpej Singh. I'm the manager of community engagement and social outcomes at Sydney Olympic Park Authority. We, we had always the intention of activating this place because we'd spoken to our local community and us workers here and one of the key feedbacks was that we wanted to, people wanted more colour, playfulness and vibrancy in our public spaces. So we had been looking at activating this space for quite some time because that's almost like the entrance to Sydney Olympic Park. We met about four or five months ago here to see how can this collaboration evolve and then we found out the way to develop it from there onward. I'm really interested in public spaces. People can come across the artwork without intentionally coming in for an art experience. And when they encounter this artwork, it will change the way that they look at that space or perhaps provide moments where people meet each other or discuss things or play and have fun in the space. As a parent, it's, first of all, it's very exciting to bring your to be able to bring your kids to say, well, this is something that I'm organized or managed or coordinated. So my son's seven years old and he said, oh, can I ride on this? I said, yeah, go for it. He was asking questions about, so what is this, is this a snake? And I was, I was able to tell him the story, oh, that's from here, or the, the dragonfly is from here. So it inspired conversation. There's lots of stories within this artwork. It has so many dimensions from playfulness to sustainability to conservation. And so I was able to have discussion with him about that. And then he went and spoke to my daughter and said, well, we need to go there again and we should bring a dice with us. When people come to the space, they can scan a QR code and it'll take them to a website. And there we have an online dice. And it's actually a dice that uses imagery from the Digby's drawn the sides of the dice and people can then tap it. So it's a Digby dice, basically. For me, all ages, like children, grown-ups, if you come here, play with this game all day or night if they want to. I don't mind. 